Do you need help organizing your house? Well, in this series, Organizing with Super Wendy, I'm going to be sharing the best tips and tricks to help you organize your home. In this episode, I'm going to be organizing my closet. Wait till you see it. It's not the messiest, but for me, it's like... It's right. By the way, I'm sorry that I have two different outfits. Um, the lighting was just bad and I just redid it, so. Oops. If you're interested in more videos like this, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Let's get started. All right, guys, so this is my closet. This is what it looks like usually in a month after I actually organize it. I just get overwhelmed and just start piling stuff, as you can see in this corner right here, on top of my laundry. Uh, been there's a whole bunch of clothes. I don't even know if it's clean or if it's not. We have to figure that out. Figure that out. But I'm gonna help you organize your closet and help you keep it organized. Hopefully, like I do. So. I'm gonna give you six steps to help you organize your room. So, step one: take everything out of the closet. Literally everything nothing left in it so once you clean it out it should look like this completely empty and this is what it looks like when all the clothes is out a nightmare step two clean and vacuum the closet wipe it down you know keep it spotless Step three, rearrange storage, anything you have in there, containers, bins, hangers, make sure everything is in its place and what you're going to use to organize everything. Step four, sort the clothing. Um, put it in piles of, you know, if you're not going to wear it this season, put it in another storage. Um, the clothing that you're using, get rid of or donate or sell the clothing you haven't used as well as shoes if you're not wearing them why are you having them just collecting dust so make sure to find ways to either store somewhere else for another season or give away step five organizing and putting everything in the closet nice and neat and the best way for you to not and the best way for you to keep it neat. And I'm gonna show you some folding tips, so keep watching. So you can see my closet. So I organized, and I'll come closer, but I organized from like long dresses, um, short dresses, some cardigans, dress shirts, um, like silky uh, shirts and pants. And then this side, it's kind of hidden. There we go. We have um, my knitted sweaters and um, some pants that I don't really use and some towels to whip my face. I have my undies in there. Um, I bought these um, foldable. These You can like cut them up and customize them. Here are all like my Spanx. Put that away. And my socks. Same thing, I just cut these out to fit the, fit the thing and I just fold them like this so there's two socks and I just fold it like that and put it in like that so here I have all my bras just uh, laid them from front to back not top to bottom that way I can see everything that I have. I have some bras that don't fit me because I am breastfeeding. Um, but I'm still saving them. Some bathing suits. And some tights. So just some things that I barely use. This is my PJ bin. Um, just have them. This one's not really... It's organized. But I kind of have to take things out in order to get to the bottom. Or whatever I need. 
And this one I have, I have scarves, winter things. And then, I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave this here, but these are my, um, what do you call this, fajas? Postpartum binder, there we go, binder. Don't use them. So those are gonna go on the first shelf, so. So that's what it looks like so far guys, nice and neat. Alright so here I have some of my shoes as you can see, um, I'm going to put them in my closet and another trick that um, so you don't use up all your space in, the, in your closet with shoes is to put them in a bin. So I'm going to show you right here. So I put my shoes in this bin right here as you can see. These are just some summer shoes um, that I will not be using in the winter. And it's really good storage because you can put it under your bed. Like that. And another good tip um, is I, on my top shelf, top top shelf in my closet, I had a lot of um, bedding and I decided to put it underneath um, my bed. So I just neatly organized the fitted sheets, the um, pillowcases, the sheets, so well, really nice and easy, really easy access, that way I don't have to put in the ladder to get all the way to the top every time I need a new sheet or whatever. So we got our um, tall boots, like so, short boots. So I got my black heels. I rarely wear them, so I'm gonna put them in the back. You know what? I'm gonna change them. I'm going to put these heels. Oh, that's so nice. I'll show you closer in a little bit. part of my closet but it's it's where some of my clothes is that I use on a daily basis is. Um, so I'm going to show you some tips on how to fold to make everything fit. So this is a tank top guys right here as you can see. I usually fold it um, halfway and then I fold it one more time and then I fold it forward like that. So it's just like a square. Which means like square. And then I just place it in there, just like that. And as you can see, if I take anything out, um, just kind of move everything out, and that's it. So here I have long sleeve shirts, tank tops, uh, t-shirts. So, yeah, that's how I keep that organized. These I kind of have rolled up like that, so they're all like that instead of being like this up. Otherwise, you have to kind of take everything out and put it back. So I literally just folded the pants like that, like that. Which one was it? Yeah, and then like this, and then I just put it in here like that. That's how all of these put it like that. And these they're the same thing, they're folded the same way, and the same with these shorts. Step six. So my um, tip is for you to take 10 minutes or so of your day or even five minutes in the morning or in the evening to reorganize your closet. Just put things in the dirty bin, hang things up, fold some things up. That way it stays nice and neat.
that's it guys we are done organizing my closet it took two days crazy it could have took shorter but my baby my baby needs my time but i hope you enjoyed this video and it helps you organize your closet or it motivates you to clean your closet um, but yeah that's it i hope you enjoyed this video make sure to like comment share and subscribe and hit the little bell for more videos don't forget to be your best, look your best, and feel your best. Until next time, bye guys. Bloopers are next, so keep watching. <laughs> These sips, sip, sips, keep. Ew. <laughs> I think I got it.